a tough test today, Dave, against a strong, prickly outfit. How do you feel the boys acquitted themselves? Um, yeah, obviously it's another 45 minutes for the majority of the squad, which was which was good. Um, had a really good test, to be fair. You know, fair play to Frickley, they've um, put a shift in, and which we knew they would do. Um, but lots to work on with us. Um, there's good things. There was few different things that um, we can use into training to try and make us a little bit better. But as you say, we're still carrying a squad of 22, um, which is. You know, obviously we're going to have to do another down soon, so performances will uh, dictate who uh, who stays and who who won't. So uh, yeah, we're, we're we're pleased with the outcome. Another clean shoot, which is which is always pleasing. Um, both games have not conceded, uh, won both games, and um, yeah, pleasing performances in some different ones. But no, um, a real good test. Obviously, a sticky pitch, so we couldn't get our passing game going as well as we could have done. Uh, but but no, really pleased. So lots to be working on. Is there anything in particular that really stands out that you want to improve upon? Um, really, it's just it's different partnerships at the moment. We're just asking the lads to go and play free. Um, we've not managed to work on loads of shape. We've had a little bits and bobs, but you know we're just getting a minutes. Um, pleasing thing, no injuries today. That's two two games we've had no injuries. There's only um, Chris Salt that's done some work today, which is his first set of three hundreds, which is going to be pleasing. Tom Davy and. Um, Bradley Wells got minutes today, in their first session back from holiday. Craig King's first game, I thought he was excellent, real standout player for me today. Um, and also with Fuller on the right, you know, had good minutes again and looked a threat. Um, got his goal with Fuller as well. So, uh, no, we're, we're, we're pleased with um, the work rate of the boys. That's never going to be questioned under me and Terry. Um, we're always getting honest performance out of us. Uh, we just need to tighten up now against, um, which is going to be a real good test for us at home. On a, on a good pitch where it's going to be wet, um, cut at the right size as well, so it allows us to try and play it down and more of a true, true reflection of, of how yeah. we can play. But um, yeah, same looking time. forward to the Halifax game. Yeah, Billy Heath sides are big, strong, physical, mm. so it will be another physical test, but a chance to contrast styles again. Well, it, it will be because you know Halifax will give us what a, a real Conference North game would be like. Um, we've got. Quite a few of the squad that stepped up from from the Evistick League, um, one or two that's been released from pro clubs. So it'll be an eye opener for one or two of them. But they've got to they've got to grow up quickly and um, realise that they're not playing at those levels anymore. And um, you know we'll uh, it'll test them physically and mentally. And um, first game at home, and they're going to want to impress. Um, we haven't got time to to bleed them in. They've got to got to realise where they're at at this moment in time in terms of the club they're playing for and. Um, you know, the part of a team that's competing for each other's shirt. So, you know, I expect a, a better level of performance. And um, yeah, we know what Billy's teams will bring, and that's why we've got the friendly. So, uh, hopefully, there'll be a big crowd in there and um, see what the new boys are all about. Yeah, the first look for the Gainsborough public in Gainsborough. So, they've been two decent challenges away from home, home comforts. We need well, to make the place a fortress next season. Well, that's that's something that you know we, we, we want to do since we've been at the club. And last year our home performances were very good. Um, you know, most of our away performances were apart from Chorley and FC United. So um, and they were both second half collapses. Um, but in terms of our home performance, I thought we were always bang at it. And considering the opposition we played, we, we were competitive, and you know we got decent results at home. So we don't want that to change, um, pre-season game or not. We want to try and build confidence, um, clean sheets, and, and winning games. That only do that. Um, but yeah, we're, we're looking forward to the game Tuesday. And just one last one in terms of the squad. Are you happy with the players you've got, or are you still looking to bring new players in? Um, I'm always looking. Um, yeah, I'm happy with the squad. You know, we're uh, happy with our recruitment this year. Um, just need to blend in a little bit more. But on first, on first showings, you know, in terms of training, in terms of um, their attitude and, and, and the application. Um, you know, we've gone to Winterton on a Monday night. We've come here today. They're both tough fixtures uh, for different for different reasons. Um, they've, they've adapted really well to that. The acid test will be Tuesday um, to see where we where we're going to shape up for next year. <coughs> um, you know, and they're just learning about me and Terry and, and about what it's like to be at games with Trinity player. Um, and yeah, really pleased on their, their first showings, but obviously loads of room for improvement. Thank you. All the best. See you on Tuesday. Cheers, Thank you. Cheers.